Did you have a good time at the movies, Chuck? Yeah, it was the best movie ever. And we even met the movie star. Whoa! Oh. Shucks, you all met a real live celebrity. He was totally cool. Working in movies sounds like the best job. <laughs> oh, Chuck, can we have your autograph? Yes, but it also takes a lot of hard work, a lot of hard teamwork. Speaking of hard work, I better get back to my customers. And I should get back to the repair center. Okay, lunchtime's over. Who's ready to play police cars and getaway cars? We could play police cars and getaway cars, or we could make a movie about them. Yeehaw! Great idea! We've already got the actors. And we've got the camera. And one star who looks good. And we've got the director. What's a director? The director's the one in charge of a movie. Since making this movie was your idea, that sounds fair. OK, bumpers up. Friends for the long haul! So in this scene, Biggs and Soku, you're the getaway cars. Soku, you say, got away. We got away. When the camera's on. I knew that. Just uh, practicing. And then Biggs, you say, looks like we're safe. And then Officer Chuck comes zooming around the corner. Then what? I chase after you guys. And Handy records it all. OK, everyone, get to where you're supposed to be to start the scene. Handy, when the camera's ready, you clack your hand and say, take one. Take one what? No, take one is movie talk that helps the director remember that this was the first time we tried recording the scene. If we have to do it again, that'll be take two. See? Oh! Good thing you're the director, Chuck. I know. The humongous chase. Take one. And action! We got away. Looks like we made it! Cut! Cut what? Cut means that the director wants the camera to stop recording. Biggs, you're supposed to say, looks like we're safe. Didn't I say that? You were close, but I really want it perfect. Can we try it again? <laughs> looks like we're safe. Looks like we're safe. Looks like we're safe. The humongous chase. Take two. Action! We got away. We got away. <laughs> it looks like we're okay. <laughs> I mean, it looks like we're safe. Not so fast. You're coming with me. You have to catch us first. Be too sure, getaway cars! Cut! Everyone okay? I'm Fine. good. That was awesome! But wrong! No, it wasn't. You were supposed to make us crash so you could catch us. Yeah, but you were supposed to crash into those tires, not the cones. Looks like we're going to have to do this again. But Chuck, the police car still caught us. That's good. It was. And hopefully this time we'll get it perfect. Let's do it again, people. I don't know why we have to do it again. Well, Chuck is the director, and that's the fella in charge, so I guess we got to do what he says. The humongous chase. Take three. <sighs> the humongous chase. Take four. Cut. <sighs> Take five. Cut. Take six. Cut. Take seven. Cut. The humongous 
Christmas trees. Take. Wow. Twelve? Action! We made it. Looks like we're safe. <laughs> Like jail for you two. And cut! Yes! Perfect! About time. Handy, let's see what we recorded. Action! We made it. Looks like we're safe. What, what, what happened? Uh-oh. I think you forgot to take off the lens cap. With that on, the camera couldn't record any pictures. Can't we get anything right? Hey, it was an accident, partner. A fella doesn't do something like that on purpose. <sighs> Let's go again. Places. No way. I wanted to have fun and make a movie, not get yelled at. Yeah, you've been bossing us around all day. And you blame us for everything. Well then, I'll just make the movie all by myself. The humongous chase. Take ten. You'll never catch us, police car! Don't be too sure, getaway cars! Er, getaway car! Doing it alone is the only way to go. Then you can be the star of your very own show. Making a movie without anyone else. So much better, cause you do it all yourself. Be the star. to yell at us again? I came to show you the movie I made on my own after you left. Did you find trucks to do it exactly the way you want? N not exactly. treated all of you. Want to work together? Chuck, I think I speak for all of us when I say, bumpers up! Friends for the long haul! Off to jail! No more crimes for you! But a lot more making movies for us! <laughs> now that's how you do a picture show. Great work, Chuck. Yeah, you made a really great movie. No, guys, we 
made a really great movie. <laughs> <laughs> Morning, friend. What can I get for you today? Gotta do some serious fueling up, man. I've got a long day ahead of me drilling into the old ground. Excuse me, sir. Uh, what kind of truck are you? My name is Deep, and I'm a drilling rig. I dig holes way down into the earth. But why? What's down there? Oh, lots of stuff, little man. Some places have salt, and some places have water. And in some spots, it's a mystery. My job is to look for those mysteries. That must be the best job in the whole world. Oh, it is. I work with science trucks, and together we discover the most amazing things. Wow. Chuck to surface. I found something big here, Deep. What is it, Chuck? What is our most famous drummer found? It's a mystery. A mystery so mysterious that the world might not be ready for it. Wow, what would the world do without you, Chuck? I don't know, but I sure wouldn't want to find out. What do you think is below us right here, Deep? Ah, now that's a mystery. Well, at least until you find it. Then, it's science. Let me get something to dig with. I'm gonna find some mysteries. Oh, little man. Hold on there, Chuck. <gasps> See if you can find a place to dig that's not right in the middle of the diner. Oh, yeah. Good idea, Dad. Besides, the best mysteries are found in wide open places. I know the perfect place to look. Dad, can I? Go ahead, son. I'm almost done here anyway. Thanks, Dad. See you, Mr. Deep. Thanks. This trick took some practice, but I finally got it. Hey, do you want to work on your new stunt? That's a great idea. But believe it or not, I have an even better idea. I just met a guy named Deep while helping my dad, and he told me about the mysteries. Mysteries? What mysteries? Under the earth, Handy. There are a gazillion mysteries down there just waiting to be discovered. That's really neat. Yeah, Boomer, that's what I thought. Do you guys want to discover those mysteries with me? Because if we don't, no one will. No one? No one. <sighs> that means we have a very important job. A very, very important job. Well then, let's go mystery hunting. To the parts yard. Bumpers up. Friends for the long haul. What are we looking for, anyway? We're looking for the absolutely, positively best spot to dig. Oh, uh, they all look the same to me. You're right. Maybe we need to take a closer look. Time to magnify. I took a closer look. This dirt patch and that dirt patch and those dirt patches over there are all exactly the same. I'm sure I have a metal detector in here somewhere. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. Nope. Aha! Whoa! Are those x-ray glasses from... The back pages of The Adventures of Super Semi! They're supposed to let you see through anything! Awesome! Cool! Dude! These will help us find the perfect spot to dig. What do you see? Yeah, what do you see, amigo? You must see something. Something mysterious? Uh, I see... Hey, right here! Friends, it's mystery time! Let's dig! <laughs> This is a great hole. See, 
amigo, but what about the mysteries? All I see is dirt. Do you see anything handy? Not yet. Over here! I found something. Something shiny. Oh! Chrome-plated extra-reflective hubcap. Now that's a treasure. A treasure? Yes. But a mystery? No. Chuck, how will we know when it is a mystery? I'm not exactly sure, but I'm sure we'll know it when we see it. Let's keep searching. Hey, a uh, spring. An awesome spring, but still not a mystery. Let's keep looking. Tired. I'm thirsty. Well, we found this flag, bucket, tires, and a raft, but still no mysteries. <sighs> Maybe we'll have better luck after a break. Who wants to hit the diner? Good idea. See, si, amigo. Let's go. You said it. Problems. We'll just find another way out. I hate to say it, but I don't see another way. There's always another way. Let's think. Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> done. All we need to do is build a ramp. We found a lot of neat stuff in this hole, but we didn't find a ramp. We're not going to build a ramp out of things. We'll build it out of trucks. Uh, you mean us? Exactly. We'll just climb on top of each other until someone is high enough to get out. Well, how will it help if only one truck gets out? Because that truck will zip around the parts yard and collect materials to make a ramp. Once we have the materials, we can build a ramp and drive right out. Sounds complicated. Nah, it'll be easy. I think Digger is the best guy to do the running around on top. What do you say? See, si, let's get me out of here. <laughs> hey, amigos, unless we dug up a pair of wings down there, we're gonna have to try something else. Okay, Digger, get up here. This is going to work. Uh, guys? How did you get down there? Okay, let's try again. <laughs> you can do it, Digger. <laughs> or we could just make a dirt ramp. <sighs> Back to digging. And pushing. And lifting. Now this is a ramp. We'll be able to drive up for breaks and back down for mystery hunting. And maybe up again for a good washing and some chrome polishing. Before we drive up, I want to smooth this part right here. Someone could pop a tire. Come over here, guys. Look at this. I think it's water. Water? It's true. Deep told me that sometimes drilling rigs try to find water underground. <laughs> Why would there be water underground? It's called groundwater. My mom told me that there's more water in the ground than in the lakes and rivers. Let's drill deeper. Uh -oh. A ramp! It's gonna ruin a ramp! That's okay. We all learned how to swim last summer. Let's get on that raft and ride this to the top. All that work and we didn't discover a single mystery. Just some boring water. Well, water may not be the most mysterious mystery, but we did discover a mystery, a mud bog. Is there anything more fun than a mud bog? <laughs>